What's good, gang? It's your boy D in the fucking building, man. Today we react to Andrew Tate's best moments. You know what I mean? Now, if you don't know who Andrew Tate is, you've been sleeping under a fucking rock. All right? Especially if you're on TikTok. You know what I'm saying? Now, um, I'd be agreeing with half of this shit he says and the other half. I, I, I say I agree with like 85% of the shit he be saying. But then like, the other half, I'm like, uh, uh, that other 25, uh, uh, cool, you know what I mean? But if you're not subbed up to the channel, go ahead, sub up. We going up, we going crazy. I want to get to 2,000 quickly, so come join the family. That's if you fucking with this video, you know what I'm saying? I don't want, I don't want you watching, man, let's keep if short. If a man isn't free to say what he thinks in the way he wants to say it, if political correctness or hate speech or whatever, whatever, not just man men. can't even express himself the way he thinks it, is he free? And what they do first is they restrict your speech, because if they restrict your speech, then they can start to restrict your thoughts. If you're not allowed to ever say it, then you're probably not going to think it so often. This is why it's done on purpose. So I don't think that society is very free at all, and I think that in regards to keeping our employment, keeping our money coming in, making sure we don't lose our social medias, every single person has to censor themselves I to agree. some degree. Every single thing I about agree. friendships are a value exchange. You think of who your best friend is, right? You gain something and he gains something through your interaction, right? Either it makes you feel happy or he can help you with some things or you help each other. Every single thing in life is about. See, I wouldn't, I wouldn't necessarily say this is using your friend though. I mean, it is, but it's, it is, but it's not. Cause when you, when you use the term used for somebody, that's like, oh, um, fucking shit. I use, I use you for, um, I use you for money. I use you for rides. Um, there is no good way to say to use the word use when you're using it for a person. I I, I can't ex really explain it, bro. But I feel like use is the, is a bad word for this con for this concept. Like for what? How you exchange? I don't have a jet. Does that mean I'm broke? <laughs> Sounds like it, bro. What are you what are you waiting in line? I hate rich bro? people, bro. <laughs> I hate rich people. <laughs> I broke. No, I'm playing. I love them niggas. I think I think every uh, rich person deserves fucking. I don't want to say apply, but some type of respect. Like you got to give it to them. Like they ain't just go get get rich out of nowhere. At, at least most rich people that I know of no of. You know what I'm saying? They have to work some type of hard. Hard, so oh, yeah, protect your spirit when you're fat. Oh, you can't do it. I can't speak you today, chat. Powers, now you're ugly. Isn't that funny? Well, how'll that work out? Here's a test when you meet a bitch for the first time. Say, what are you doing next week? Correct answer. Oh, nothing, just home. Attractive. That's what I want to hear. You ain't been nowhere. That's what all of us want to hear. Nowhere. Just home. Okay. What are you doing next week? Oh, well, my friend has a art exhibition, and then my, gir my girl knows this guy oh, who's that. doing this thing, and we're going to this. Party, this is a launch for this new clothing line, and then on Wednesday, it's my friend's birthday. Cut her off. Her name's Chloe. She's so funny, and we're gonna go there. And then they said it starts giving you this busy schedule. Ho, slut, shut up. Thing. Can you admit your monumental failure in this book? Bro. I can't drive. The things rich people do, bro. Tell her that's way more effort than walking. Why don't you just get your fucking Bugatti? The traffic stopped traffic she comes out instead of just turning right and going on her way she comes and just crashes into this car female and i sat there and i thought how are women allowed to drive what wait how? females can't drive a man is good enough at driving to know he's not a good driver but women are such bad drivers they genuinely think they're okay drivers it's remarkable if you're truly shit at something you now I'm just reading this shit right here. Females can't drive, but when he said that, hold on. How are women allowed to drive? Check it out. How? Females can't drive. A man Boom. is good enough at driving to know he's not a good driver, but women are such bad drivers, they genuinely think they're okay drivers. I agree 100% with that. I agree 100% with that. Now female, the females can't drive part, I don't know about that, because I know I know some females that can't drive. It's remarkable. If you're truly shit at something, you can't even tell your crap, right? If you're completely deaf, you don't know you're bad at piano, because you're an idiot. Yo! I spent three million dollars on cars, and then Earth decided to snow, with no consideration. The fact that every single day I drive a supercar. 
I'm one of those guys with a supercar and kicks out sometimes. Every day, I drive one of my cars from there. And look, this is bullshit. Luke. Rich people, bro. Like, what the fuck are you gonna do? Pay Mother Nature to act well, to act right? At home. I'm certainly not one of them gym bros who only trains and does nothing else. You know what I'm not doing? Cutting up broccoli and putting in little boxes. Mm. Mm. If I make enough little boxes, maybe I'll get some biceps. There are there are literally Wait. there are literally gay porn movies less gay than meal prep YouTube videos. Gay. Super gay. gay. Your reality on women is war. Before you I ain't I get what he said, and I'm not about to rewind it. You will only even acknowledge he exists if he's ignored how he feels 99% of the time before that. Because if he was sad most of the time. Hold on, I really want to see what the fuck he was talking about. Gay porn movies less gay than meal prep YouTube videos. Gay. Super gay. gay. Your reality on women is war. Before you say to that man, you can have a day off and you're allowed to be sad today. You will only even acknowledge he exists if he's ignored how he feels 99% of the time before that. Because if he was sad most of the time before that, he never would have got to a place where he could attract a woman like you. The man who works in Starbucks, who's sad all the time, you won't reply to him. Neither will any other female. There is not a female on the planet who's invisible today. You can be a four, overweight, you'll still go to the club and get attention. 99% of the men go to the club and nobody even f***ing talks to them. So if you just sit here and say, I'll You know why that is, though? You don't know why them four out of ten bitches at the club get attention? It's either a nigga that get no bitches that want you, or a nigga like 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 they don't be thinking up here. They don't be using their head to think. They be using their other head to think. You know what I'm saying? So it, it be like that sometimes. Not in my case, but for other dudes, it, get a G, yeah. a big G, a boss, a millionaire, and let him have a day off. Very nice of you. I'm sure you would. If a guy who wanted to have days off all the time, he never would have got important enough in the first place to attract a woman like you. And that is the reality. And what's your net worth? Net worth is very difficult to quantify. If you, had to go if you had to go liquid tomorrow, I'll give you a year. I'll even give you a year to say you can sell your company. But it's like, all right, we're playing a game in life. Yeah. Whoever has the most physical liquid money wins. Yeah. Yeah. You have one year to accumulate it. How much do you think you it's difficult. It is difficult. The reason I'm giving you this answer, not a very short one, is because I think that my companies rely so heavily on my brand that they're very, very difficult to sell. But 300, 350, okay. easily. So, rich ass every nigga. Every single addict I met is an extremely emotional person. And when I say emotional, I mean the kind of people who jump around in nightclubs and are extremely happy. That's still emotional. They have no stoicism. You see these people in the club. Yeah, the club. Britney Spears, Rihanna, yeah, that. Morons. I could win a hundred million dollars and I wouldn't scream like that. And these people are screaming because Rihanna's on a stage 40 meters out of that festival. I'll probably cry. Hundred million? I'll probably cry. Every time we're there, we get in trouble with the crazy Moldovan. Hundred K, I wouldn't cry. These guys are just crazy. And I say, you know what? Part of you has to respect their absolute nationalism. Like, where are you from? America. Oh, America, you come Moldova, yeah? They don't want to fight you now. Like, they're like, whoa, what the fuck? But it's how they are, but it's like... I heard about that. Moldova's a crazy... It's dangerous. It's very dangerous. Let me turn this down. We've been down. there four times, and twice we've done that. So that's a 50% attack rate. Right <laughs> <laughs> what is the chance of me beating one of you at Fortnite? Because I've never played before. Zero percent. Yeah, probably... The probably me beating you in boxing, pretty much. Yeah. Is it, that, is it that that low? You need a, you know, four years of practice nonstop comes to, like... You know what I'm saying? Like, you would need to learn, like, every control. It's It's very... It's probably one of the hardest games to like actually learn. Man, man, you a soldier? I swear to God, keyboard and mouse Fortnite. That's one, bro. It ain't no joke, bro. If you know how to play Fortnite, keyboard and mouse on Fort. If you know how to play Fortnite, keyboard and mouse, you got it, bro. I've tried it, bro. I, I'm not. No, no, no. I was, I was decent at it on controller, no cap. But keyboard and mouse, hell no, no, no. Something. Okay, so you're basically <clears throat> getting in a bus, right? There's a hundred people. You jump from the bus. You land. If I'm not getting rich off of that, guarantee, I'm not about to put my time into that. Hell no. That sounds a lot like my life. What do you mean? Like, like a hundred people dumped in one place. Most die. I'm the last one standing. You may do it with the little controller. I'm doing it out here for real on the street. I've been jumped four times. Every time I was jumped, I didn't see it coming, but I heard it coming. You're walking and you hear those footsteps coming up behind you. That's your chance. That's all you got. That's your chance to not fucking die. Instead of doing that, you want to listen to cold play in your fucking ears like a little dickhead. When you put your headphones in and you're walking down the street listening to your music, you are a fucking target. I have autism, just to be honest with you. 
I guess you could say autism that. Autism is a very, very large. I put fell asleep, chat. Because you have autists who I'll are fell asleep. And you have autists who literally can't even function in society. What would you say is a characteristic or a particular behavioral pattern you have, which is different than a normal person, for example? What do you do that's not normal? I would say people talking to me say something to me, and I do not care, and I have zero empathy towards what they're saying. <laughs> is that what you got? That's autism. I don't care. What happened to Mary? Oh, what? There was five people on a train track. I don't care. Heartbreak, depression, sadness. These are all fantastic motivators. I'm telling you why they're a fantastic motivator. You go to a guy who's heartbroken. He has all the motivation in the world to send 300 text messages. Life's going to hurt Did me. How you use that pain is completely and utterly up to you. You can use that pain to galvanize yourself as a man and become a better man you've ever been. I'm not saying that I'm only successful because of some chick. I'm saying that every single time that I was heartbroken, I never wasted a second. I was never wallowing. Russians in general aren't very animated when they speak. They sit still. They say yes. They say no. Mm, yes. Blah, blah, blah. They're very, very calm. They don't like to talk too much. However, he was told that many Russians are trying to learn American mannerisms. Many Russians were learning to move their hands a lot more as they speak. They like the idea of being animated. If you're constantly animated, your movement doesn't scare people. So if I'm still and I decide to pull my weapon, you're going to notice. But if I'm always animated all the time, if I'm always moving every time I talk, you're not even going to fucking notice by the time I pull my gun. Firstly, you said she shouldn't be with you for something. She should be with you because you are something. Well, how do you become something? You become that's, something. That's what you, you become wait. You become something by doing things. Oh, you, you're trying to separate the two. Like, look at this nigga, bro. Get a massage by Lord know whose grandma that is. Like, bro, you rich motherfucker. Man, imagine me just on a podcast talking to y'all niggas. You know what I'm saying? Or, 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 or on a podcast with somebody else, just getting a nice massage. You know what I mean? Chatting it up. You probably used to that shit. Rich ass nigga. They're separate. They're not it, you, separate, separate. separate. They're, They're not. You is a lot of things. Your, your achievements is a small thing. Being not, not, successful not, isn't. Not in the realm of a man. In the realm of a man, oh. your achievements are 85% of all of who you are. As a man, you are judged solely on your status. You don't even have to be good looking. You need to be important. And you're only going to be important by achieving important things. But I want all the people, all the feminists watching who want to go cancel people, go cancel this guy because I can tell he gives a shit. Don't try and cancel me. What? I don't give a fuck. What the fuck? There. Cancel me. I do not care. See, <laughs> this is the difference between. Hold on. This, this is a man that's all about his business, businesses, money. Uh, you know what I'm saying? Not used to social media. This is his only income. Social, well, that's how his income started from social media. You know what I'm saying? So he don't give a, he, he, he just now getting on social media type shit. He just now being hip about this shit. So he don't give a fuck. And he got rich without it. He can stay rich without it. Him, he got rich with it. You know what I'm saying? Not, 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 not nothing bad or anything that, that I'm saying about him, but he got rich with it. So he's going to he's going to watch what he say, you know what I'm saying? And 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 he don't want to be canceled. He's very worried about being canceled, you know what I'm saying? Hey, I, don't I think it's kind of dope what he got going on. Like the nigga, he don't really give a fuck. That's dope. That's dope. I, care. I exist outside of the matrix. No one can damage me. Doesn't matter. Now when you talk about the matrix and shit, you lost me, bro. I do. Man, this guy, no. he's a assault. What the he is a misogynist. What are you, I can't believe what you just said. What are you doing? But they real close, though. Like, I peeped that they very close. It's people like him that are keeping women back. That's the reason you don't have high-paying jobs. Whoa! Rover Andrew! It's 100% this guy. I can't believe the same. What the fuck? About me. <laughs> you should only drink water to begin with. Sparkling, as everyone knows. I don't like sparkling water. It's disgusting. This is a setup. Now I'm starting to understand. You're deliberately antagonizing me. My blood pressure. No, bro. I don't, like, well, I don't like sparkling water. You're scared of bubbles? No, it just it doesn't it doesn't even hydrate you. <laughs> of course it fucking hydrates you. It's water. What do you think? Water doesn't hydrate you? You're scared of bubbles? Scared of bubbles drinking fucking okay, soy? But you can't. Wondering why you have no motivation to do a single fucking push-up? 
at 21 years old when you have unlimited money and all the time it, it, that nigga ain't has got a little chubby i ain't even gonna hold you i ain't even gonna hold you that's what that that's what that 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 money gets you you know what i'm saying I see that you are a white man, so you may He's not have that personal experience. Actually, actually, no, you're you're wrong. Can you're you wrong. Google and put a picture of my father on the screen? You just failed on step one by identifying me incorrectly. <laughs> so, <laughs> I'm not, not knowing two. you. I no, don't know step, you. Of course you don't know me. Why are you assuming? I don't know you, so I'm guessing you failed. So, you did the same thing earlier to me. In which area have I once failed? We can run it back to you? the first 10 minutes. You don't want to run this interview back, because when you <laughs> run it back, you're going to see yourself get smoked the whole way through. <laughs> so listen, my dear. Listen. Mom is calling me. What does she want? Answer the phone. Go on then. In the meantime, I yo, put money on a distant. He gonna say some. Mom, do you want ten billion dollars in your bank account? Is that? I'll play the other amazing song. Hello, mother. How are you? How rich I am, and that is completely true. Any other questions? I'm actually live on the internet right now. There's three thousand people watching me take this phone call. Uh. Sure. You need anything? More money? Sure. Do you want more money, mom? Well, hit me up anytime. Your wish is my command. I respect that. I respect that. I respect that. But nah, chat. Uh, big shout out to Andrew Tate. He's doing this. He's killing a game right now on the internet. Um, I don't have the mindset like him yet, but I'm one day. I'm gonna be getting a massage from from one of y'all grandmamas, smoking a fat cigar on a podcast. Or just, just anywhere, for real, in the pool, just relaxing, looking at a good view. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> I don't know what the fuck I'm talking about right now, but nah. Appreciate y'all for tuning into the video. Make sure you subscribe, hit that like button, and turn on post notice. My brother or my sister, now y'all have a good blessed day. This video was long as fuck. And if you made it to the end of this video, give me one of these emojis. Y'all know what? Or nah, give me this emoji right here. Y'all gotta know this emoji. Is it this one? This one? This one. Give me that emoji right here if you made it to the end of the video. Peace, love, positivity, and um...